And if you're patiently waiting for the day to come when you can put your shovel away for the winter season, you'll have to keep waiting. Winter Storm Carol will certainly leave its mark on Northeast Wisconsin and Pete has our severe weather coverage and joins us with more on what we can expect throughout the day. Yeah, it's going to hold off for a little while before we get hit with some accumulating snow. Now we did get a little bit of light snow earlier, but you can see where the snow is. It's to the west and the western portion of the state really. There's a winter weather advisory in effect for the north, north of Green Bay that is, and that's the winter weather advisory. Maybe a little bit less snow, but most of us will get four to six inches of snow and more like the six inches uh, to the south of Green Bay where there's a winter storm warning in effect until nine o'clock tonight. This is one of the computer models we use and you can see five, even seven inches, pockets of seven inches of snow possible anyway in that winter storm warning area. So here's what to expect. Most of us getting four to six inches of snow. It'll arrive after nine o'clock, about nine o'clock, 10 o'clock in the Green Bay area. It'll be heavy at times. We'll also have some south southeast wind 10 to 20 miles an hour. So that'll mean some blowing snow this afternoon, heavy snow, blowing snow, and that'll lead to some tough driving conditions, certainly on your way home. Now it's tapering off after seven o'clock tonight. Temperature right now, and you can see we have really kicked those temperatures up. That warmer air is pushing in. That's one of the reasons for the snow. 25 degrees already in Green Bay, so we'll be back to 20 at 10 o'clock, 23 at 3, and 19 degrees at 7 o'clock with snow on the way, four to six inches of snow, and it's called Winter Storm Carol.